So part three will be easy because it's back to G6, G7, which you already done. Our C6, C minor six, which is the same thing as part one. And then we're gonna move down to the beginning of part two, which is just that G here. And if you're not sure what that is, go back to part two. That's the first chord of part two. And then we're gonna skip the E7. We're not gonna do it. We're gonna go right from that G to the sixth fret, third string. Middle goes the fourth string, fifth fret. And first at the sixth string, at the fifth fret, that's the A7 again. And now, right to the D7. And you can use your thumb at the top if you want to. So all we did, instead of doing four chords of part two, we just did one, two, three of them. We skipped the E7. We just went right from the G to the A7 to the D7. And then you go. <laughs> so I'm just going fifth string, pull off to the third fret, second fret, open. So we have. Same thing. Now, the next part will come in part three, or part four. That was part three. I'm so confused. I'll see you at part four.